I am painfully aware that many citizens of all walks of life who are sincere patriots are becoming concerned about the length of time it is taking to crush the rebellion in our country. We have one and only one aim in prosecuting this war. It is to ensure that coming generations will live in a happier and more stable country. Let us accept our present difficulties as the price we have been called upon to pay in order to ensure a peaceful and prosperous future for our children. General Yakubu Gowan, 1967. I don't know this face, but please give me time. Let me examine invisible words written on the forehead. You know what? Why don't you join me? Let us take a look. Does it look like a face that can see clearly now? Study the contours of his famished smile, temples in turmoil. Note the dry streams of naked shame running amok all over his cheek. Touch his brittle jaws, where truth once suffered severe caricature. Follow one compromised vein after another. Trace it to the Golgotha of condemned nostalgia. Yeah, pity those innocent eyelids. Sentenced to death, uprooted for failure to blow away tears. Don't let these stinking eyes fool you. They reside in a stadium of humanity, but hunger to belong. Appeasement always backfires in spontaneous frowns and exaggerated hiccups. <clears throat> Avoid his clipped eyelids. Let his grey moustache, collectors of iniquities, be. As for the bags under his eyes, those are the graveyards of deserted empathy. Symmetric nightmares reincarnate when the gods have their last laugh. Ears long bombarded with lies can only stretch out in resignation. That permanent ball by the left eye is a mark of betrayal. A reminder of that old concession that stinks up till now. Why fury of time attracts reprehension? Heaven scrawls at acquired giggles. Then it sprinkles ashes into a mouth full of boiling blood. It is the law of nature. It is the nature of the law. Off the microphone, draw the curtain. Flash flood of reckoning is on the shore. Abusers of cosmic fire only sleep and swim in the rivers of regret. Rebellion unfinished at least its ceasefire. Returns with reward soaked in vengeance to find you wherever in your head you are hiding. You are validated. Yes, you are. For you have inherited forever the weeping infant's cups. Squeeze your wilting facial muscles. Sneeze out all imaginations. Maybe, maybe, maybe it will help your ears to bear the sound that nobody else can hear. The day the show closes, you will contend with the long night of being locked up in a nutshell. Until then, let the interpreters of deformities read your lips. Let them regurgitate what those lips used to suckle on. In spite of Ojuku's wicked propaganda, religion has never been a cause of conflict in Nigeria. And it is my fervent hope that all Catholics, Muslims, and Protestants will continue to work and live together in harmony. General Yakubu Gowan. 19. 67. He say, he say, he say, nonsense.